I'm going to show you the art of sabrage with a glass. Now, sabrage is possible if the bottle is cold enough and if it is carbonated, aka bubbles. So beer, sparkling wine, champagne, Prosecco, this will all work with sabrage. I normally use my sabrage sword. However, today I'm going to show you how to do it with a wine glass. Please don't use a very delicate wine glass. The more expensive the wine glass, typically the thinner the glass, and this may cause the glass to shatter. So you want to use quite a solid wine glass as it needs to have a base which can impact the glass on the top without shattering. With the bottle, you want to remove the cage. As soon as the cage has been removed, you need to be careful and make sure your finger is on top of the cork. Locate the seam of the bottle. This is the line that runs up the bottle to meet the glass ridge at the top. I'm going to slide my glass up the seam and then impact at the base of the ridge. You want to do this firmly but not too hard as otherwise you'll shatter the glass. Hold the bottle facing away from you and not towards anyone. No glass will go inside the bottle allowing it to be perfectly safe to drink from. Let me show you how it's done. When you're ready place the glass onto the seam. Do a practice run and then when you're ready count yourself down. In three, two, one. And that is how you sabrage a bottle of bubbles with a wine glass.